How about your goal this year is to take a full day of break every week? I mean, if you look at... If you look at how much I stream, it really is only like six times a week. But recently, as the fest got closer, right? I'm sure you guys could tell the streaming schedule was getting much thinner, which is fine because it's fest coming up and, you know, everyone's here and I want to be with them and I need to prepare. And, you know, so I I realized I was like, oh, th where are the eight hour streams? It's like a one hour stream three days ago. Only six. So that's normal, though. I feel like a lot of streamers feel motivated to stream every single day. Physical, mental health is all very important. I feel like my mental is really good right now, though, because after fest, it's like a big burst of energy, right? Seeing everybody give it their all on the stage, it really motivates me, you know? All streamers don't make a ton of music, Callie. I guess so. And part of me is kind of like, I don't know, maybe it would be nice to focus on music some more, but at the same time, because I feel like talents that make a lot, a lot of music also don't stream the same way that I do. But at the same time, I'm kind of like, what do I want to be known for? You know, the streaming thing is really just kind of, I just do it for fun. It doesn't really feel like a job to me, if that makes any sense. But sometimes I feel like you gotta kind of let the world know what you want the thing that you do to be. It's not something that I, it's not one of those things where like, some people feel like I want to do something that I know I'm the best at, right? Um, I think in terms of music, I don't think that, I think that's not how I am. <laughs> I just, I just do it because I like it, but at the same time, I still want people to see me as like a music talent, more so than a streamer. Does that make any sense? But then I stream so much, people can't help but see me as like a gung-ho, grindy streamer, right? Not as much as some of the other grindy ones, right? But I still grind. I've still done some really, really long streams and a lot of them consecutively in a week, right? Can't help that people start to think of me that way. But I, I really am more about like, I want to be seen as like a, a music talent, you know. Why not both? I think it's difficult to to really showcase yourself hardcore as both. It's a, it's a tough thing. You can do it, but it's hard to do. Pretty half and half at this point. Yeah, but I don't really know so much if I want to be. I'm not gonna stop streaming though, because it's too fun. I have too much fun, but it is what it is. I just care a lot about it, I guess. I really care a lot about making music. That's like my main thing that I really put a lot of me into. A lot of my heart and soul. I have lyrics to write. No! I mean, yes, yay, but also no! Ah. The next is classical. I'm pretty happy where I'm at right now, but I feel like I still can make a wide range of things. It's, it's very difficult, I think, when you're starting out trying to like get deals and tie-ups, because a lot of times I feel like the, the people that are asking for a song have a very specific idea. In the case of like, for example, like Metal Gear, right? They like wanted a a rap song, like a silly shit posty rap song. They asked for that specifically. Even if I, and like I asked, I was like, can we do like maybe, I don't know, a, a rock song or something like that? And they're like, no, we want a silly shit post rap song. And I said, okay, I want a sneaky neaky. Same thing for Go Getters, where when we were like all brainstorming about the song and how to write it and whatnot, we had all these ideas and all these demos and whatnot, and they specifically wanted the sound that you guys heard. And they got it, they got it. We all worked really hard to make that sound, right? Very poppy, party-esque song. Especially based on like what they told us the ending was gonna be like, which I will not spoil, of course, and I'm not allowed to say, but we had to create a song that specifically fit that. And if I did something like rock, rap, etc., that I'm trying to do right now, it just wouldn't quite fit the same. But they still wanted Mori, right? Because of that, they're like, we want you, but this is, you know, the sound that we want. Even if it's not consistent with what I'm trying to, like, make more of my original music recently, that's fine. I have to be able to make it, no matter what it is. I have to be flexible, even if it's not the core genre that I'm trying to expand into, you know? 